Good morning, everyone. I have something kind of fun to share today, and I'm going to show a picture of what I want to talk about today. It is a piece of cake. I found this picture that I really like this particular one. If you can see it, it shows the great big piece of cake here. It shows the one individual piece of cake. If you can see this picture, <clears throat> it's a beautifully made chocolate cake with uh, luscious looking frosting. It has sprinkles. It even has a cherry on top. So this is like a perfect piece of cake. So I want you to keep this picture in mind. And a, a verse that came to me this morning to go with this picture and a little story I want to share <clears throat> is in Matthew chapter 6, verses 33 and 34. This is Jesus speaking. I'm going to read this in my amp or the Amplified Version. Jesus says, but first... And most importantly, seek, aim at, strive after his kingdom. This is God's kingdom and his righteousness. God's way of doing and being right. The attitude and character of God. And all of these things will be given to you also. So keep that in mind. <clears throat> and I'm going to share a little tidbit, a couple other little things here. Whoops, hang on a minute. Okay, this here, all right, so this little tiny article <clears throat> in reference to the scripture that I just read, Matthew chapter 6. Okay, I want you to keep that in mind as well as keep in mind this picture of this beautiful cake, okay? So I'm going to tie these two together, all right? And it says, the call of Jesus to his followers to seek first the kingdom of God is in contrast to those who are filled with anxiety over provision for daily life and therefore focused on material, temporal things to the neglect of the spiritual, eternal things. Okay, I'm going to stop there for just a second. And then before I continue this, the thought that came to me this morning <clears throat> when I envisioned the piece of cake and that scripture is when we have to have the cake first before we can put the frosting, before we can put the icing, before we can put the sprinkles on. We first have to bake the cake. The cake is the foundation of the dessert that we are going after. I know some people, you know, I mean, you might, I've done it myself, open up a can of frosting, have just a spoonful of it, but I'm not going to sit down if I want a nice dessert and just eat a whole uh, um, jar of frosting. That, that just wouldn't even, doesn't even sound good. But I will make a, bake a cake, put frosting on it, put the sprinkles, put all of that on, and, and enjoy a really wonderful dessert. So that's where I'm going with all of this. When we seek first, that, that's just kind of how that tied together for me. We need to have the foundation first. That's what I believe Jesus is saying. So I'm going to go ahead and read this again. When we seek first the kingdom of God, and I want you to liken the kingdom of God in this reference. This I, Maybe this is like my little parable, I, I guess. So when Jesus is talking about seeking first, bake the cake first. He knows that whatever it is, whether it's material things that we're after anything else that we are seeking or wanting in our life that that's like the frosting that's like the sprinkles the cherry on top but we still have to have that cake first we have to have that basic foundation so i'm going to talk a little bit more about what that the cake part is the foundation part okay so i'm going to read this start this little again the call of jesus to his followers to seek first the kingdom of god <clears throat> what he was referring to matthew 6 33 to 34 is in contrast to those who are filled with anxiety over provision for daily life and therefore focused on the material, temporal things to the neglect of the spiritual, eternal things. So in that case, I want you to think about if we were to focus on, I have to have that frosting, I have to have those sprinkles, I have to have that, none of that is going to be as sustaining as like the basic foundation, like in this case, the cake. So the early Christians lived in in a society or societies that were considerably less security oriented than what those of us living in the West have been used to. I want you to think about this because they said they didn't have health care, 
homeowner's insurance, no social security, no retirement funds, <clears throat> life insurance, etc. Of course, there were many people in the world today whose experience might be similar to that of the early Christians. If any of us are living in the, in the um, like in America, for an example, we do know those type of securities. But whatever kind of environment we find ourselves in, whether we consider it stable or unstable, secure or unsecure, the word of Jesus is the same. In other words, what Jesus spoke when he said this, Matthew 6.33, to, to, <clears throat> to that audience he was speaking to then, those words are the same for us today. We, we right now, in tw the year 2022, we are to seek first the kingdom of God and his righteousness, his way of doing things first. Before we look after, seek after the frosting, the sprinkles, the cherry on top, we as people are to have the spiritual and the eternal as our primary focus. What does it mean to seek first the kingdom of God? It means putting Jesus and the things of the Spirit first in our lives. Okay? And um, again, there's, there's always so, so much information in a lot of these articles <clears throat> that I share. But my little videos are usually pretty short. So I, I just uh, share just a couple little things with you. Leave the links to these little articles in the description so you can read it uh, yourself um, so those those were just my little thoughts this morning so uh, I just thought that was kind of fun and again I just want to close again um, with this picture I really truly believe that uh, when we will focus on the foundation the basic part like in this dessert you know you, you couldn't have this wonderful dessert this this particular baker for whatever occasion that this was for they started with the cake they started with that basic so and then they were able to to add all these other things which again like what Jesus said seek first the kingdom of God his righteousness his way of doing things and all of these other things Jesus said that himself he said that all of these other things will be given to you as well so that's what I wanted to share uh, with everyone today. And I hope you have a beautiful and a thankful Thursday. Thank you again for listening. If anyone ever has any comments, um, something they want to add to what I'm sharing, please feel free to do so. Thank you again. Till next time. Bye.